If 30 cm cube of oxygen diffuses through a porous spot in 7 seconds, how long will it take 60 cm cube of chlorine to diffuse through the same pot if the vapor densities of oxygen and chlorine are 16 and 36 respectively? Solution This is a question that has to do with the gas laws and amongst the gas laws, the one we'll be dealing with as regards this question is Graham's law of diffusion, which states that the rate of diffusion of a given volume of gas is inversely proportional to the square root of its density. And same way it can also be said that the rate of diffusion of a given volume of gas is inversely proportional to the square root of its molecular mass either vapor densities or molecular mass both is applicable but here we are dealing with vapor densities according to graham's law we have r to be inversely proportional to the square root of its density that is the rate of diffusion of gas is inversely proportional to the square root of its density now when we have two gases being considered then we'll be having r1 over r2 that is the first and the second gas to be equal to square root of the density of the second gas divided by the square root of the density of the first gas according to the question we are dealing with here now the first gas here we'll be considering is oxygen while the second one is chlorine so let's proceed the rate of the gas is not given. That means we are expected to calculate that on our own. But the densities of the gases are given, which is 16 and 36 respectively. Let's calculate the rate of diffusion of each of the gases. So for oxygen now, rate of diffusion of oxygen gas. We have rate to be equal to volume in centimeter cube divided by time in seconds. So rate of oxygen gas now. According to the question, the volume given is 30 cm cube. So we have 30 divided by the time it took the oxygen gas to diffuse is 7 seconds. So this gives us 4.23 cm cube per second. Let's proceed. We've calculated the rate of diffusion of oxygen gas, then it remains the rate of diffusion of chlorine gas. But we won't be able to do that because we are not given the time taken, that is the time for which chlorine gas diffuses is unknown. So we won't be able to calculate the rate of diffusion of chlorine gas yet. Then this leads us back to the formula. Now we'll be representing 1 and 2. We'll be replacing 1 and 2 with oxygen and chlorine. So we have RO at this rate of diffusion of oxygen over RCL, that's chlorine, to be equal to the square root of the density of chlorine divided by the square root of the density of oxygen gas. Let's continue. So we've gotten RO, that is the rate of diffusion of oxygen gas to be 4.23 units centimeter cube per second. The rate of diffusion of chlorine gas remains unknown. The density of chlorine gas is 36. By the density of oxygen gas, is 16. 
So here, yeah, rate of diffusion of chlorine is unknown. So let's substitute the values. We have arrow to be 4.23 divided by RCL, which is equal to square root of the density of chlorine gas 36 divided by the square root of the density of oxygen gas 16. Let's proceed. So here, yeah, 4.23 over RCL equals square root of 36 is 6, and square root of 16 is 4. So from here, we'll cross multiply. Then RCL equals 4.23 times 4 divided by 6, which gives 2.82 so let's add the unit centimeter cube per second now we've gotten the rate of diffusion of chlorine gas and don't forget that from the question we are being asked to calculate the time taking that is the time it will take chlorine gas to diffuse so to do that we'll go back to the formula that says rate rate equals volume over time so time here will then be volume over rate time of diffusion of chlorine gas Is then equal to the volume the volume is given to be 60 centimeter cube divided by the rate of diffusion which is 2.82 centimeter cube per second and this gives us 21.3 seconds approximately 21 seconds and this is the final answer now with what we just did now we've gotten the time it will take 60 centimeter cube of chlorine to diffuse through the same pot and the time it will take chlorine gas to diffuse is 21 seconds and that answers the question